Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Pastor Shonda and this is Thriving Tuesdays. It's hard to believe that in the past eight weeks, we have been through so much. We have been through an evacuation that lasted 10 days. Then we came back to power outages and a water line break. And here we are sitting in day nine of our second evacuation um, because of the wildfires that are taking place. Oh yeah, and did we forget that we're sitting in the midst of a pandemic? I've been getting your, your emails and your prayer requests. Please keep them coming. And one of the questions that's been asked is how, uh, how can we stay encouraged in the midst of everything that we're going through? And for myself, I found that I'm, I've found myself now more than ever immersed in the word of God. And I invite you to do so as well. Today, I just want to share seven quick texts with you that we can use as our hope, promises from God that we can cling to in the midst of everything that we're going through. The first one I want you to remember is that he is working all things out for the good. That's Romans 8, 28. The second thing we can remember is that he will complete his work. And that's Philippians 1, verse 6. The third thing is that he will carry us. And that's found in Psalm, Psalm 68, 19. The fourth thing is that he has promised to strengthen us. Isaiah 40 verse 31 reminds us. The fifth thing he reminds us in 2 Corinthians 12 verse 9, he says, my grace is sufficient. The sixth thing that he says is that his goodness is satisfying. And he reminds us of that in Jeremiah 31 verse four. And, and finally, the seventh promise that he gives to us during this time is, is that he says that he will give us rest. And he says, come unto me, all of you who are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. And that's found in Matthew 11 verses 28 to 30. Listen, if we want to thrive on this Tuesday, we must start taking God at his word. God, you said that you're going to carry me. So carry me, God. God, you said that you're you're full of goodness and you want to satisfy me with that. So please, God, satisfy me with your goodness. God, you said your grace is sufficient. So please, God, show up and show me how that is. We got to start praying the promises back to God. Listen, we want to continue to grow and thrive together. So the message today is take God at his promises. Listen, I love you. We will see each other soon. Take care and God bless.